say hi from Cherish Math. This is our question. Three circles, each of radius one unit, fit inside a square such that the two outer circles touch the middle circle and the sides of the square as shown. Given the centers of the circle lie on the diagonal of the square, find the exact area of the square. The baseline of the square is in fact a tangent to the circle. And I'm going to make a radius here. And this radius is actually perpendicular to the baseline. The red dotted line here forms 45 degrees at the corner of the square. So I can find out that for this part, it is the same as well. And by looking at the part here, it forms an isosceles triangle. And now I'm going to work out what is the length of this green line located here by using Pythagoras theorem. I know that this radius is in fact is given as one and this is an isosceles triangle. So here is one unit as well. So the length of this green line is square root of 2. And the same length apply over here as well, where the length here is square root of 2. I know that the radius of the circle is actually one unit. So I label here is a straight line that connecting the radius of the circle each with a radius of one unit. And the total here I got here is four. I'm going to add up the green line at the bottom and the green line on the top. I get another two square root of two. And this is in fact the diagonal of the square. Next, I'm going to label the side length of the square as x. And I'm going to solve the problem here by using Pythagoras theorem again. x square add up with the x square is the same length as this 4 plus 2 square root of 2 and square up the entire thing. And this is the answer of the question. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.